Hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel. Today's video will be a collaboration video on a what's in my toddler's diaper bag. Over on Grace's channel you will find a lot of great content on beauty, motherhood, and lifestyle. She has a beautiful little two-year-old daughter named Naomi. She's a wife so you can definitely go over to her video when you're done with mine and you will not be disappointed. She posts videos weekly Definitely check out her information. I will link it in the description box below. So let's go ahead and get started. Hello, so in this video today, I'm gonna go over the essentials that I carry in my toddler's diaper bag. The diaper bag that I currently use is the Michael Kors Tote Purse. It's in blush pink. So previously, when she was about, up until about 12 months, I was using the blush pink Michael Kors backpack as her diaper bag. So with the diaper bag, because it is a tote purse that I just converted into a diaper bag, um, I think it is Riley. I'm gonna link it in the description box, but I think the little insert that you can use to convert the bag is a Ryla, I'm not quite sure. So I don't want to give you wrong information. I'll just put it in the description box below that you can buy to go in any purse. This is the small size. And you can buy it as an insert to go in the purse. In there is a larger size where it would fill up the whole purse. And that way you can just have all of the compartments and it will be converted. But because I put other stuff in the bag as well, and when we're on the go, I'll put my own stuff in, you know, my keys my iPhone as well as my wallet so that when we're going in the store I just have one bag so the first thing that I have in a bag since I went over the organizer it comes with a changing pad with this automatically I never use this one because I have my own changing pad but it's quite big as you can see and it's a wipeable material but that attaches on the side. You can put bottles, any type of pacifiers. My daughter never used a pacifier. And any other lotions, anything you need. But on this part, I just keep our diaper case, which is the Skip Pop. And it's in the blush pink. The little wipe case, I said diaper case. Wipe case, where you can pull the wipes up and you add them in here. The wipes that we use are the Huggies. I love Huggies wipes. I've used other wipes. Now, I do also use the Cloud Island as well from Target. And I will use the, I don't think of the other one, Honest. So I was using the Honest Diaper Delivery Service because I love their diapers, the little designs. But I no longer use those because I find that the sizing is not as wide as they are long. So I just, like we were having too many little blowouts with those which i love the designs but for a practicality it just wasn't working for us unfortunately so they can make the diapers a little wider when they get bigger and they're moving around it just doesn't move work for me with the moving baby but i love the diapers designs and up until she was one that's basically most of what we use now we use huggies which are the little movers so these are the ones we keep in here for our diapers and I just insert this here along with the skip pop and that's what I use in the insert. Then, now in the bag, it does have compartments where right here you can put extra stuff in. I don't usually use those sides except for every now and then. I, okay, correction, I do. Well, I actually do use the insert parts. What I put in the sides is her, well, on the go, they're not disposable. They're washable on the go silverware. So we're at a restaurant and she has her food. We'll just use the little silverware because I haven't even noticed or asked if restaurants have many silverware for kids. Most of the time I see they give you plasticware. So she's not at that point yet to use regular plasticware. So we just use our on the go. And this is by Nuke. And I can actually link this where I got this from Amazon as well. And I brought a pack of the little on-the-go placemats from Walmart. I originally got a pack from Target 
and then I found them at Walmart and I found that Walmarts are a lot cheaper and I mean they're just plastic so I mean you're just gonna tape it down and I like that these from Walmart are all four corners so you can take down the whole thing which is the ones from Target just take down on the side my daughter has got to the point where she's smart enough to pull it up along the side so we always have these in our bag as well so that way when we're on the go she has our food out or she has a snack we don't have to worry about it getting on the table so that is great you can throw it away when you're done the next thing we keep in our bag is i got it from my job is this little um outdoor wellness kit where it has the spf sunscreen the hand sanitizer insect repellent the insect bite relief and the after sun spray so just for summer we had this and in florida i mean basically you can use most of them all year round but for the most part this is very important during summer so we had it in the bag the next thing i always keep in my toddler's bag is a change of clothes and this is what we currently have in here now so i'll be changing this out to something that's a little more warmer and probably about a month when it is warmer here so up until about mid-october we still have warm weather here in florida versus at the end of september it's fall but it's no big difference for us it's ever every now and then some days are about 70 which is great and I also keep a snack in her bag all the time. Right now she's been loving the mini vanilla wafers and we love the honest apple juice. So I'll keep that in her bag as well as her sippy cup. Right now she's using the Tommy Tippy cup, the little straw one, because she loves to drink out of a straw. Her dad shows her to drink out of a straw. She is just all about a straw. You know, if she sees a straw, she wants it. So she has her own straw cup for when we're on the go. And this is the actual changing pad I use, and it's by Skip Hop. And it came in my original diaper bag that I had when she was first born, which I stopped using after about the first two months. So this is the one I use. I love the color and the design on it. So I use this on the go, even though it's the other one that came with the insert, I use that. Then I have some extra wipes, which is by the brand Honest, which I love. And this summer we have to keep our little fan in here for her, the mini fan for it's like a keychain fan. So we also have one that goes on her stroller. That's a clip one that we use when we went on walks outside. So we were somewhere with her stroller. Those are very good. And then they have the foam like material, the same as the regular fan. So they put their hand in the way of the little propellers. They're not hurt. So this is great for on the go. Also this Eddie Bauer little Holder, you can lock it onto your stroller and you can insert the shopping bags or your diaper bag or anything else and it clicks on so that way you don't have to worry about all these bags in the undercarriage. You can just have them conveniently on this strap. So I keep that in here as well. Then I have some little neat cheeks, little wipes. They're scented. And they also have a stevia flavored taste where you wipe their cheeks. I'm not sure where I found these at, but I think I found these on Amazon. I'll link these below as well. So I like these little packages because it's easy to wipe their little face and hands. And then we also keep a bib for when she's eating on the go. It's the little ones that catch the food in the tray. And it's wipeable, but the back has this soft, material so that way we don't mess up our clothes while she's out eating because my daughter like most toddlers will make a mess and we can't go anywhere without her bubbles so we have a bubble machine that she uses in the backyard this summer and then she has the little on the go bubble necklace she loves bubbles so we use that and keep that in her bag for something to do when we're like stopping at a park or somewhere outside to amuse her while we're waiting or if we're in a restaurant and we're on the outside waiting we'll let her do the bubbles because you know you have to keep the toddlers entertained then this is a little bag that i found um about a year and a half ago right before she was born at my target in the little dollar area as a little rose little 
jewel on the side and then the bag. So I just use this to keep all the odds and ends in here like a thermometer as well as a medicine gauge syringe, the drift um, little stain remover, kind of like they do with the um, Clorox stain remover. This is drift for the babies. This is like, yeah, it works great. You rub that on there and then wait till you get home, clean it out. You don't have to worry about any stains. So we also keep the boogie wipes on the go and we have the regular big thing of boogie wipes, but this is the travel size. You need to have a nose syringe. And then I'll keep a little miniature lotion. Right now the one I have is the um, Honest Miniature Lotion because this came in a little set that we had. Keep sanitizer with us as well as the little cotton nail flushables. More so for me. This is for her, the little, um, what is this, a little Arm & Hammer, little diaper, little bag, the little baggies. That way you can just drop a diaper. If you're in the car or something, you have to change a diaper, go ahead and tie it closed, and then when you get where you're going, you can throw it out. It masks the smell. As well as Lysol, if you have to do a diaper change in the car. Um, she's still teething, so I do carry the baby um, aura gel. So I use that as well, but for the most part, she hasn't gotten all of her teeth. She's about 17 months. And at this point, she still doesn't have all of her back teeth, which is crazy to me because my son by 12 months had all of his teeth. Then I keep a little nail clipper just in case, as well as a glass nail file. That's like for the babies. I got these off of Amazon as well. And then a little Aquaphor diaper rash cream. I always need a first aid kit. So this is the Johnson & Johnson little first aid kit. I the Clorox wipes because after we do a diaper change, I try to wipe down the diaper pad just to keep it sanitized because you might get a spill or something. But you know, just to be safe, you want to make sure you, you know, keep it clean. So that's majority of everything that we have in our diaper bag. So I hope you all like this video. I hope these are some items that you may or may not carry for your kids. And if there are items that you do carry for your kids that you think that are toddlers, that's very important to have, go ahead and link it below and let me know because that may be something that I could put in my diaper bag, change out some of the things because I am going to um, change out some of her things probably in another couple of months that she doesn't necessarily need anymore but right now these are the things that we're using but let me know below what you use for your toddler and what has worked for you as well as what type of diaper bag you use if you use a tote purse or the regular diaper bag style i have been thinking about getting a new diaper bag one that maybe zip around and i can hold on my shoulder kind of like a purse style but it's closed this does close where it does have it where the actual tote purse can zip but as you can see i have it full so i don't zip it closed but i may start zipping it up but then again i may just get another bag that i can have for that this is easy because i can grab one hand in without having to use both hands to unzip and put it into the bag so thank you so much for watching and if you haven't subscribed i would appreciate you subscribing to my channel and that way you don't miss an upload from me. Ring the notification bell. You can follow me on my Instagram as well, Truly Me TV. And thank you and have a beautiful day. And I don't really break too easily, but I'm worth it. Cause I'll slip into your dreams tonight. Oh.